book is hefty. It is 600 pages, and it's like, if I threw this at a person, like, it would do some serious damage, so, like, might just carry it around so I can have it in case somebody messes with me, so I can just, like, uh, you know? Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with a another haul video. I went to the Dollar Tree in the States a couple of weeks ago, and I found a couple of books which I'm like so excited about because they were only a dollar. Like, what? Here in Canada, popular books are like thirty dollars, and if you find one in a thrift store, they're usually at least four dollars. So like, a dollar. Your girl is so happy. So without further ado, let us get started. The first book I'm probably like the most excited about because I saw it and it's like in perfect condition. And this book is like twenty three ninety nine, I think in Canada, so like, I got it for a dollar. And it is Afterworlds by Scott Westerfeld. I was super excited when I saw this, and honestly, I'm not even 100% sure what it's about, but Scott Westerfeld and, like, perfect condition, so I bought it. <laughs> the next book is The Friday's Society by Adrian Kress, and I have never heard of this author or this book, but it sounds so cool. It's basically about these three women who are apprentices to a magician and it's basically they find a man who is murdered and then it's up to them to try and like figure out who murdered the man but apparently they're all like super feminist and like awesome and like stand up for themselves and stuff so I'm like really excited and also like I like the cover so I bought it. The next book I bought solely because I thought the cover was super pretty. Because I'm a cover buyer? Sorry, not sorry. But it is Wildfire by Karsten Knight. I'd never heard of this book. It follows a girl who goes to an academy to escape the death of her sister. And apparently there's like reincarnated gods and goddesses who are called to this academy and she ends up being one of them. So like, <laughs> sounds cool. I need it. That was a weird noise that came out of my face, but... That just shows how excited I am about this. The next book is Inland by Kat Rosenfield. This book was popular in like 2014 on booktube. It was like just released and everybody was reading it. I can't remember what people said about it, but I saw it at the Dollar Tree and I was like, it's a dollar and it was popular. I need it. So now I have it. The next book is The Bodies We Wear by Jane Roberts and I honestly don't know why I bought this book. I think I just really liked the cover because I've never heard of it before, but Apparently it's a revenge story and your girl loves herself some revenge, so I'm not mad about it. And then the final book is Foundling and this is by DM Cornish and it is the first book in the Monster Blood Tattoo series. And I saw Missy from Binge Reader talk about this book and then literally that same day after I watched the video, I found it and I was like, it's a sign that I needed in my life, so I bought it. Apparently it's one of her like favorite books, so I am excited to get into it. And also there's like pictures and stuff in it, and you know, your girl is a sucker for books with pictures, and of course now, because I want to show you the pictures, I can't find any, but there you go. Pictures! Exciting! Alright guys, so that was my little Dollar Tree haul video. Let me know down below if you've read any of these books or what you thought of them, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!